Three, two, one. Testing. PC action. discovered a great application it's called safe IP it basically allows you to surf the internet anonymously however said saying that if you do use it for any criminal activity you can be traced have you ever been frustrated trying to access websites overseas like Hulu or maybe the BBC iPlayer including Netflix that's just to name a few whenever you try to access them because you're in Australia this is your result you can't access because you don't live in the country and again you don't live in the country so we're gonna fix that up we have what is known as a VPN and it's called safe IP free anonymous surfing great little tool and I'd recommend it to anyone however it's only available right now for Windows I'm using Windows 8.1 OS and it seems to work well once you've downloaded it open up your download folder and cut and paste onto your desktop there's no bloatware there's no malware and it's a great application once you've installed it open up your options and there you have it at present this is my regular IP address in Australia so let's change it to Buffalo in New York and it's one button click and there you have it it's really really safe now let's see if we can access the internet websites overseas what this application does it tells the websites that your IP address is in that country you can use this application to surf the net anonymously to download torrents and to access sites like this including the BBC I might add there you have it we're now watching hulu.com in America I've deliberately cut the sand off for copyright reasons I'm only gonna play it play this for 30 seconds so you can just see that it does work very well and there you have it now I'm back on my own IP address and we'll go to London change the IP and there you have it we'll open up Explorer and try to access the BBC iPlayer 
you probably noticed the gold stars they just indicate that the servers are busy right now and you can try them again later this application is free there's no limits on it whatsoever I think you can buy it for $39 that's um, Australian dollars I think and it will give you a faster download speed and give you access to more servers but it seemed to work very well and there you have it BBC iPlayer and you can watch any program that's on BBC if you're a do doctor Doctor Who fan well you've got access now <laughs> it's a great application click it on to full screen and there you have it it's great this is playing because my IP address is in London at present However, we'll shut this down and I'm back on my own IP address now. So we'll try and access the BBC iPlayer again just to show you that it's the safe IP that's allowing us access to the BBC website. I hope this helps and I do appreciate you liking subscribing and sharing and as you can see I'm now on my own IP address and I don't have access just to show you I'm still on my own IP address and there you have it it's a great application and now we can move on to the interesting part downloading torrents the speeds that you can achieve well if you're still with me at this point in time thank you for sticking around I'm sure that you'll find this quite interesting as you can see I'm downloading at the speed of 940 KBs on my regular IP address in Australia on ADSL that's considered very reasonable this shows you how your IP address will appear to other people using the uTorrent client and now we'll click on to Chicago in America change the IP address and let's have a look at the speeds 920 KBs per second I'll keep it on there just for a little while so you can see for yourself how consistent the download speed is and that's in Chicago course there are a few conditions with the the torrent client that you use you torrent for me seems to work quite well I've just switched from my own IP address to another USA IP address I'll start the download again and you can see it building up for yourself The total size of this is 883 megabytes as you can see
and as it build, speed builds up, the ETA time drops. It's going to take approximately 23 minutes at 950 KBs per second. That's quite a large file to download in such a short time. stop the download and now we'll go to the UK start the download and you can see for yourself again the download speed is building up very nicely So you can see for yourself that while I'm downloading this torrent, my IP address is being camouflaged. I'm doing this anonymously. From a virtual proxy network number, which at this time is in London. I'm sure you see the gold stars once again the three of them well they're just indicating that them particular servers are busy and we can try them again later on thanks for watching